The only people who don't want to disclose the truth are people with something to hide. Well, 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 look at this. Look at this. Apparently Obama has heard all of the criticism from his friends, which we chronicled here in the first hour. All of these Council on Foreign Relations types, you know, these uh, current former diplomats, all of them leftists, openly writing of Obama's incompetence, suggesting that he needs to broom his entire foreign policy national security team, that there's nobody in there qualified as his embarrassment, and they're worried about security of the company, uh, country, and they literally have. This is Leslie Gelb and this guy named Jim Patterson, and they're going to be more piling on. They're, they're literally writing that they believe Obama is so in over his head he doesn't have slightest clue about American foreign policy. I still, I, I, I don't think these people are ever going to get it. And if they do, they're never going to admit it. He's not incompetent. That's the thing. He is not in. This guy may be, in fact, one of the most skilled con men that's ever come down the pike. One of the most accomplished, astute con men ever. The idea that Obama is incompetent? You have to purposely make the decisions he's mating, making. You, it's not that you don't know the right thing to do. These are conscious decisions. It was a conscious decision to snub that event in France. It's a conscious decision to legalize, formalize relationships with countries who have been traditionally enemies of this country, such as Cuba, uh, who knows uh, who else. It isn't incompetence. And I don't know how long it's going to take his buddies on the left to get there, but right now they're stuck in the idea, my God, we really fell for this guy. We thought he spoke well, he was sophisticated, he was articulate. But man, he doesn't know what he's doing. He needs to fire everybody. He needs to replace Valerie Jarrett, everybody in his apparatus, security and, and uh, foreign policy just needs to broom him. And these people suggesting this are not insignificant. The only people who don't want to disclose the truth are people with something to hide.